You have two claws that you can use at, at the, the same, same time. time. What's going on, everybody? Jay and Bree here to do a review. You will sent me. You will sent me a new product, another caliber. Some humidity in there. Oh no, it's from the juice. So what's special about this? It's another pod. Everybody knows pods at this point. But what's unique is you could use two different flavors with one pod. And you can choose to vape one flavor, the other flavor, or feel a little frisky. We do both. No way. At the same time. At the same time. At the same time. At, At the, the same, same time. time. Not so loud. Bring down the levels. Try it again. <laughs> so you have two different co coils. Apparently, <laughs> what's... <laughs> so apparently inside of this, you have two coils, right? And um, what's unique about this? You can vape one side or the other side or at both the at the same time. <laughs> so what's unique about this? This is the blooper reel, by the way. Um, so what's unique about this is what? what? What's special about this? What's going on, everybody? Jay and Bree here. And today we're back at you with another At the same review. time. This is definitely not making a video. All right, guys, what we're looking at today is the UL product. Basically, you have two different coils that you could use at, at the, the same, same time. time. <laughs> Why are you yelling? You can make it like we're twins. You have two coils that you could use at, at the, the same, same time. time. And uh, that's good. Flavor is between the fingers. That's what it says. What do you say? You're crying? I'm crying. Well, because I was just out of nowhere? Yes. <laughs> Show me the video. What is it? Show me the video. How fake do you want it? How fake do you want it? Yes. yes. Great video. <laughs> um, anyway. Anyway, this is called the You Will Explorer. <laughs> it is unique, though. Being able to use uh, two different coils independently. We've seen tanks like this, RTAs. We've seen RTAs with three. The trifecta thing by Joy Tech. The five, the Kangatech five, had... No, that was five different coils, not five different There, juices. There was one that we carried at the store. The Tri, the, the one that had yeah. the, three, the three slits in it. This has got some significant weight to it, USB-C. A lot of people love Caliber. So when you pop that off, there's quite literally two coils inside of it, and they come out. So one coil could go bad, and you could swap it, it out. It vibrates. How do, you, how do you know which coil you're using? Press the up button once to making sure that there's no websites. Press up on the button once to activate both coils. Press the right to use the right. Press the left to use the left. Press down to actively alternate. So up is both. Right is which one? Right. Down is left? Nope. Right is right. Left is left. Up is both. Bottom is surprise me. Wait, you, that's not what you said. Press the down button once to activate alternate mode. Yeah. Left I is for that left means... coil, right coil, and then up. Both. Okay, so the down, you just kind of swap. Is there a fire button? No. The whole, okay. Yeah, All the right. whole thing's a fire button, no? All right, sample not for sale. So we're going to put Saito and Lost Recipe. That's going to be interesting. And then in mine, I have Potion 68 and Juicy. Oh, you're going fruity. Yeah. What is up with the colors of that Potion 68? It's been through some stuff. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, we'll see. Mm. This is going to be interesting. Okay, filling is a little hard. Yeah, because the coil gets in the way. Right? You are trying to fit two coils into one. This is very interesting. And the fact that they are legitimate independent coils. Well, this has been done before with one coil where you can activate what a failed device. Kanger Tech 5.6. Did a review on it up in the corner there. Um, very interesting. You were able to change which coil was firing. Not so much which tank. This pod is substantial too. Yeah, I mean, it's got two coils in it. And you can see by looking at it, those, those are filled up. I don't have no idea what I put in each one. I'm just going to go for it. 
Let that sit for about five minutes, not so much. And this is gonna be draw to activate. I'm just going for it, I'm not even gonna wait. In your peripheral box, you get two extra coils and a charger. Five clicks and turn it on. Woo! It vibrates! There is no feedback for when you swap the coil. Okay, that's interesting. It doesn't light up either. It lights up when you put the pot in. I don't know when else it would light up. Okay, that's interesting. Go ahead. That, that, is, weird. that is really cool and really weird at the same time. Okay, you will, you win the innovation of the year. Wow. Okay, I smell it. This is, this is really, I wish that, so just one flaw right off the jump. When you select that pod, it does not let you know which pod you're on. Like if you click it, there's no haptic feedback and it does not light up, but it does switch. And when you are hitting it, it does light up. So right now I'm on the right. Now look. It lights up both. Look, I'm on the I'm on the right one right now, right? Oh. Look, I just clicked this one. Mine doesn't do that. Look. Okay. Is mine broken? How you, oh God, I'm getting loopy. Three hours later. So Brie probably fast forwarded all that. It took us forever, or me forever, to figure this out. Right, right when you get out of the box, you fill it up, you vape it, right? That's on that side. Now, me pressing this is doing nothing, right? So now if I go one, two, three, it'll, now it's in activation mode. Now I could change it. See, now it's in both, now it's in bottom. So once it gets into a mode, you have to press one of the buttons three times, and then it allows you to program which one you want it to vape. Which one do you want it to vape? That's the right. The right one. Okay, so that might be. So that's the left one, right? So now we're going to go one, two, three. Now what's that side? Yes. See, see. Yeah. So th three times, I don't know why it says just press it once. It, that's not right. You have to press it three times in each side to activate program mode and then press the button that you want to fire. Got I'm it? I'm getting it to work with one now. Because it's it, you're just doing it after you vape. It's when you don't vape for a while, oh. it says, no, nah, man, I got that coil selected. Like, for instance, this one's been sitting, right? That's that button. It won't let me switch. Now, now it is. Nope, now it's alternating. So I go one, two, three, press up. Now it's both. So it gets wow. stuck. It gets stuck in a weird loop. Man, that took forever to figure out. This is the first time that the manual's been correct. Wow, well, I don't know about that. Well, I don't okay, so it's very innovative. I would just tell you well to fix their manual because I had to sit here and finger bang this to get this to work. Now you can see that it is working. I'm getting loopy as shit, but you see that they're both lighting up. Right now it should let me just select one since I just vaped. No, it's not. It's not letting me select the right one. So then I go one, two, three, you'll see the lights flash and then you select it, then it'll work. It also vibrates when you push it three times. Okay. Yeah. So once you got to figure it out, it's a fantastic product. Hopefully you saw this video on how to do it because that manual, no good. Uh-uh. Um, yeah, because when you read the manual, it says, press the four-leaf clover-shaped button to choose a working mode. The corresponding LED indicators will stay lit according to the choosing working mode while vaping. Press the left button, left coil work, right button, two coils uh, up, and then down alternating. Yeah, the, uh, no. It, it gets into a mode after it's been sitting for a while where you can't just press that. You have to do it where you press one of them three times and Until then they'll vibrates. flash or vibrate <laughs> yeah. and then you select the coil. Good product. Yeah, it's cool. Don't, it's let, the, just... don't let the work, don't let the working around. Wow, I feel high as hell. 
don't let the workaround get you upset because, and you are able to choose more airflow or tighter restriction depending on which way you vape. Just keep in mind if it does go into standby mode, it, you just, did they flash? There we go. I should do both. Yeah, it's, it's not in the manual, so just keep that in mind. You like it. Yeah, now that I know how it works, Yes. You were pissed off that it didn't work. Three seconds ago? No. Three seconds ago. Fucking ten minutes ago. This video was entirely because it doesn't say anything. And you're, you basically I had to figure out how does this work because I thought the battery was dead. It it it's very innovative, very cool. All I say is just fix the manual and all your problems go away. Just add a line in there. If it locks, press one of them three times, problem solved. Extremely innovative for what it is. I think it's super badass. Keep in mind, because you're splitting the tank in two, although the pot is bigger, you're going to get loose, less juice capacity. Do you like it? Yeah. Yeah, I think it's different. I think it's cool. I think that the settings are a little complicated. They are. <laughs> they are. But once you got it, you got it. Good? Yeah. Good. I've kept it real. And I kept it real. I, I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. And I've kept it. And I kept it real. Have, Have you? you? Bree. Jay. Out.